What is going on YouTube? It is Flashback here. Today we're uh, checking out a custom, uh, it's called Drift Playground in the workshop. And it's a very uh, open map, open style concept map here. Uh, it's actually made by the same person who made the Drift Fest mod. And it's not, it's nothing overly spectacular. It's just a very good start. A very good start, a good test track to kind of get the hang of each car and really just practice uh, drifting on the game in general. Which is exactly what I'm going to be doing here. This map features this one very tight, highly high skill area, section I should say. And I can never get it right because I think I just suck at the game too much. As a roundabout right here. Now oh, I, I can do better than that, I know I can. Roundabouts easy. See how easy this roundabout is? See how easy that is? So so nice, so nice. Just rip it, and then I'll go over it. Maybe not. Did, did I? Did did I really? I legitimately just got high centered. Well, in that case, let's get back over to where we were. Go ahead and head this way so we'll act like we're coming off the roundabout here. Drift off onto here. Kind of follow this track portion in here. Brings you into this uh, large, long, windy section here. Which is probably the highlight of the entire map, if I'm being honest. I mean, it definitely needs a little more separation between the track and uh, the grass. But it's just a lot of fun to just drive, and I'll actually keep it going straight through here. At which point I'll go ahead and rip it here. I'm going to just keep on, keep it coming through here. I'm actually, going to turn it back around here. go and bring it through here and slam it all the way sideways through there bring it back around now oh, come on I'm getting a little bit of frame drop here and I know exactly why I'm just too lazy to fix it I'm gonna just rip it around there come out of that corner nice and strong and then from there you go pretty much to the end of that section. And you have a small slalom area. Which, in my opinion, might be a little too tight together, but at the same time I might just not be good at drifting on this game. Which very well could be the case. The one thing I can do is run straight into it, because that's totally what I meant to do. Nope, this is what I meant to do. Come on. I know I can do it. Nope. I cannot do it anymore. There's a, there's a rental in multiplayer that's actually re really easy to do that on. I'm of course playing with Moon Gravity on because why not? Makes everything nicer. The entire thing is surrounded by the square uh, raised platform here. Which, I don't know. I don't really know what it adds. Maybe just a couple of high-speed sections, but not even really sections. Yeah, I definitely can't really call them sections, but they are definitely something. Okay, I'm going to bring it back to this section again. Oh, and Moon Gravity takes over. Not to worry. And then you have this whole contraption here in the center. wonder, can I go through this lettering? Good. Made by Accelerator. Which I'm not going to hit that yet. It's mostly just a raised uh, section. For now, I'm going to do this roundabout.
Keep it nice and steady, nice and steady. And pull it out, just like so. And then we'll go hit this thing that is a little, that is actually really difficult to uh, run with moon gravity on. I've also noticed it's really hard to run in the AM4 race spec. These raised uh, sides do make it a little harder to drift the way I'd like to. You know what you can do. I think you know what I'm doing. My car is too long for this. I need something much smaller than this. So we'll go ahead and just come down here. Follow it on down. Drift around this corner here. Oh, there's a, there's a slight ramp on the side of the track there. And we. So that's pretty much all there really is on this track. There's also this really small figure eight over here that I guess I'll go hit real quick. Me and the map creator were actually on this track doing some tandems uh, a couple nights ago here. It really was a lot of fun. Of course, map creator is Australian, and I'm American, so the ping difference was, or the latency difference was, fairly significant. But I mean, it is what it is, right? It's gonna happen from time to time. Bring it back onto the track here. Yeah, that's that's this track, the Drift Playground. Uh, do check it out. It's kind of it's very unique and. The creator is very much so interested in continuing his work on this and other maps. And this is my favorite part. You know, of course, moon gravity. Alright, so, on that note, everybody. If you did enjoy and you would like to see more drifting or anything really in Wreckfest, please remember to hit that like button. Please consider subscribing if you haven't already subscribed. Because, I mean, why wouldn't you? And... Before I go, there is a new group on uh, on Steam, a new Drift Fest community for drifting in, for drifters in this game. Do check it out. It is uh, open to the public, and you can do things like this. Because why not? Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. We will see you next time. Until then, as always, take it easy. Yeah, that's kind of cool. Whoa. It's an M. I just realized that. I don't think it's supposed to be, but it is now. Hello? Track? Oh, there it is.